This weekend, thousands of dogs across the country are here in Central Florida competing for America's top dog. Yeah, it's all part of the American Kennel Club National Championship, and this two-day event is more than just dogs being in the ring. New 6 insider Crystal Moyer has a preview and shows us what it takes to be best in show, Crystal. Oh yeah, you would think that this is Miss America. I mean, these dogs are just gorgeous, well-behaved, and spend a lot of time training for this event. Local competitions are underway right now at the Orange County Convention Center ahead of this weekend's main event. Come on, real big. Meet eight-year-old Ruckus. This Scottish Terrier may be small, but he loves competing in agility competitions, and he is fast. His handler getting quite the workout keeping up with him. Oh yes, very tiring. And it's my, been, been my passion to show people that Scotties can do agility because when I first got into it with the Scotty, um, they told me that Scotties didn't like agility and couldn't do it. One of the most challenging parts of the course, the weave poles. There's 12 of them and that is not something a dog just naturally does. But Ruckus completes it with ease. That's a boy. He'll be competing in agility as part of the American Kennel Club National Championship over the weekend at the Orange County Convention Center. It's a challenge, no matter what the course is, it's a challenge. More than 5,000 dogs will hit the mat and will be judged over the weekend, pawing for the top prize. He'll watch them move from the side. He'll watch them move going away from him and coming back toward him. And then he'll go over them. He'll actually exam, physically examine each dog. And he'll be thinking about all those details that are described in that breed standard. So eye shape and color, ear length, how their uh, movement is described, their temperament, because every breed is unique. And dog shows are a process of elimination. So every day starts with the breed judging. There'll be a best of breed winner. They, that dog moves on to the group judging and those seven group winners move on to best in show and at the end of the day we have won. With so many pups around you have to wonder what happens if there's an accident? We have an extensive cleanup crew that's available standing by <laughs> to clean up any messes that happen. So it happens and then it gets cleaned up very, very quickly. These dog and handler duo say it all comes down to trust and teamwork to show off their skills. It is definitely a team sport. If you haven't attended an event like this before, you'll want to brush up on some dog show etiquette. If you're coming out to the events, come sit ringside, watch what's going on. Um, if you have someone that looks like an exhibitor sitting next to you, lean over, ask them if there's something that you're not sure of when you're watching it. But the most important thing is not to walk up to pet any dogs without asking the handler first, whether it is an adult or a child, please check with the handler. Um, sometimes there are dogs that are easily distracted, so if they're trying to get them ready to go into the ring and they see somebody coming up, they're so excited to say hi they forget to focus on what they're supposed to be doing. Along with several events and competitions running at the same time, the American Kennel Club Championship also has a food court and vendor mall where you can find all types of items to spoil the pup in your life. So much to do there, let me tell you. And you know, all through this week, they've had competitions at the Orange County Convention Center, local kennel clubs. Today, they will have the junior competition. So those are kids and teens that are out there competing with their dogs. And the prizes include scholarships, $150,000 worth of cash, and that top prize, 50000 bucks. Now, you can attend it for free. You don't need a ticket or anything. You can just show up. You may have to pay for parking at the Orange County Convention Center. This might be a family fun event to just go check it out and see what the dog shows are all about. Just reminds me of that movie. Have you guys Best seen in show, that, right. Mm -hmm. That movie is hilarious. <laughs> With Eugene Levy. <laughs> yes. I think the last time I watched yeah. it was Christmas of last year. But I mean, to go see it in person and meet all of the handlers. Pretty good, pretty good assignment there, Crystal. It is so cool. No, <laughs> I learned a lot. Yeah. I've never been to a dog show before, so mm -hmm. definitely learned a lot. A lot goes into it.